Hello, it's me again. And any guess on what are we going to do right now? Of course, there's no need to guess. It's very obvious that we're going to make mango float. Anyway, this is my favorite dessert of all time. And here are the ingredients you needed. First, the all-purpose cream. Any brand will do. You can use Nestle if you want. But I prefer this one because it's cheaper than the Nestle brand. Next is the condensed milk. Any brand will do also. And this one is just transferred in a contain another container because it's not safe to put the condensed milk in the can for too long in the fridge. Next is the Graham crackers. You don't need that much. 200 grams will do. Next is you need a rectangular shape. Oh, oh yeah, you need a rectangular shape um, container. And last but not the least, the mangoes. You need to slice the mangoes thinly and in lengthwise. Um, so let's start making the mango float. Um, before I forgot, you, you will need a, a pitcher or anything that you will pour the liquid here and so you can transfer it easily in a container. Later you will know what, what are we going to do with it. Okay, pour the all purpose cream. You will need two all purpose cream for this and about five ripe mangoes. Your kid can do this. Even your kids can do this. You see, my assistant is a kid. <laughs> okay, next is the condensed milk. You will put... Okay, that's it. Oh, oh, careful. And stir it. I think you'll need a um, half, half cup of condensed milk. Stir it and now I will try to taste it. Depending on how sweet you want, you can put any amount of condensed milk. I guess you need okay that's it and stir it again and let's check the sweetness don't put the condensed milk all together Okay, the sweetness is good for me. Then let's start. Let's start with assembling the the crackers in the container. Right now we're assembling the Graham crackers and if the cr crackers doesn't fit in your container, you may cut them into pieces. Now we're done assembling the graham crackers in your container all you need to do is pour the the all-purpose cream and condensed milk mix okay right now we're pouring the all-purpose all cream like this lightly and uniformly okay you can do my assistant is covering the Graham 
crackers right now. You will need to cover the graham crackers with a all-purpose cream and condensed milk mix. And then it's time for the mangoes. Just arrange the mangoes in the container like this. You see, the kids can do it. It's very easy. You can teach your kids this very easy dessert. Here. You need to cover you need to cover the graham crackers. Okay, then we're done and then again you're going to pour the milk. She's pouring the milk right now. You will need to cover the mangoes again. And actually, we're going to do this again and again until your container is full. Right now, she's spreading the, the milk so that all the mangoes will be covered with it. Okay, we're done with this and Again, we'll put the graham crackers. Let's arrange them again. what's left of the milk mixture and this is what left for the green crackers. I told you you don't need that much of the graham crackers. Then the last part is if you don't have the crushed graham you will have to crush the remaining graham crackers. Just use your rolling pin Put it, put it in a, a plastic bag and then, or a ziplock and then try smashing them with a rolling pin and then there you go. You can have your crushed grahams. But right now we have, we've purchased crushed grahams and this is how you're going to do it. You just have to spread this one on top of the milk. This one is the last part. You will need to sprinkle it thinly and uniformly and cover the white parts so it will look presentable. Just go on 
nervous. <laughs> it's her first time to be filmed. Just cover it. 